Hello everyone. Thank you for watching our presentation. Today I'm going to talk about uh, our research paper. The topic is apartment or house. First, I want to introduce our group members. Dong Jun Wang. It is the writing and the data analysis part. Next is me. I did the questionnaire part. I wrote some questions and uh, went to some public place to get before the answers. And uh, Qi Wang, she recorded every meeting. She wrote down the results uh, we get every time. And the last member is Xin Yang Liu. She made the teamwork schedule. Okay, now, the reason why we're doing this research is that we found there are more and more apartments built in Toronto. And they have great uh, occupancy rate. So we can so we concern that people are more preferred to live in the apartment because of the fast uh, lifestyle in this society. People want to have small apartment to re to reduce their works and uh, their pressure. Uh, we do this research to find the tendency of the house uh, of the house a property market in the city. And there are a uh, uh, demand increase in, in apartment market. We also look for the lifestyle of young people in Toronto. Also, this research will define which kind of house is better for young people uh, to live now. And what kind of occupant uh, accommodate is uh, affordable to young people? Mm, the people from 25 to 35 who live in the city, such as Toronto, uh, live in two kinds of accommodation, house and apartment. The house is more expensive to young people to own it. So for young people, the apartment is a good, is more good choice. Uh, next, uh, there are the four main questions for our research. First, <clears throat> what is the benefit to have an apartment compared to a house? Second, why do people live an at apartment? Next, what are the expenses to live in the apartment? The last one is, what young people can save if they live in an apartment. Uh, next, I'm going to talk about the research object. Mm. We want to find the current situation to define if there are more young people living in an apartment instead of a house. And also, we will try to explain why, people, why young people choose to live in an apartment in the city. Uh, the result is going to show up the lifestyle of young, of young citizens and uh, tell the investors which accommodation is needed. Next is background. Uh, because more and more people going to city, they want to live in the city, so they making the house housing demand the housing demand makes the house price getting higher and higher every day. Uh, because of this situation, uh, because of this situation, it uh, increasing the occupants, uh, it increasing the occupants rate of the apartment. So more and more young people they pick up pick up uh, apartment to live. Okay, next uh, Xinyang Liu, we are. We are talking about our working plan and the time schedule. Thank you. For the methodology part, we are going to define problem first and then find article which is related. After that, we will analyze these articles and find evidence and theories to support our idea. Next. We will have our own survey to have the important data and analyze this data to get the numbers that we need. Finally, we integrate everything to complete the report.
Here are our task completing dates. In September, we, we will have a meeting to determine the topic and the purpose and starting preliminary research online. In October, we need to research three online news and four academic journals and then do the research analysis. In November, we will carry out question survey and the data analysis. At the end of November, we will done the final report draft. For the basic work plan, from September 21st, uh, we will meeting for topic. And uh, also, we will begin find out questions until September 23rd. In this step, we will define what we are going to research. After that, we will do the preliminary research and analysis until October 6th. From November 9th, we will do the survey and uh, we are going to list a question paper and hand out to people at mall or some public place. Then we will gather our survey and do the data analysis. The final report will be right from November 30th to December 5th. Also, every Tuesday and Wednesday, we have a meeting in the school, except those days I talked before. For proposed budget section, we will meet in the school every Tuesday and Wednesday. This will be in the schedule whole term, at least 12 days for writing every part of a report, and 10 days we will use for research and analysis. And we will have two weeks for question survey. Now, I'm going to sum up result. From our survey, 40 people from 20 to 35 years old who live in city answered the question. 75% are around $45,000 income live. And 62 people are living at apartment now. Most of them are live at the apartment to living expenses. The significant point to young people choose it their accommod accommodation is money. After research, we target the income, lifestyle, and uh, tendency. And the most important thing to people choosing their accommoda accommodation is income. Money affected, affects the lifestyle and young people are more at low income level. So that apartment should have a good occupancy rate. Those articles we search online show reasons and uh, give us the uh, states. This absolutely supports our discussion that more people live at apartment and they benefit from low price, great location and uh, low maintenance cost. We confirmed that more than half of young people 
currently live at the apartment by our survey and uh, find the tendency of apartment market will uh, will grow up from lecture research is we can see uh, we can see apartments become practical living living way because of its special uh, advantages. These advantages are more uh, suitable to, to the modern city and, uh, and the fast uh, lifestyle. The apartment offered convenience and uh, financial benefit to, to, them, to them to satisfy their requirements. I'm going to talk about our discussions, uh, hot apartment, hot apartment market, and the influence of high price of house. The first one, how hot apartment market. We see t uh, sixty-two percent of our survey objectives live at apartment recently, and uh, seventy-seven point five people are under the 60,000 income level. So they are, they are most uh, young people. Young people are really hard to face the, their financial problem because they are just uh, start their careers. So apartment will be a good choice to them. More 25 to 35 years old years old people will be apartment renters in the coming decades. From literature research, we say the apartment vacancy rent of Toronto City is only 1.4 in 2011. Obviously, apartment market is hot now and will be more hot in the future. We need to build more apartments in the city in next year, and uh, the investors will find the op opportunity to take the advantage. And the second uh, discussion is influence of high price. Because of the high price of house, young people can get can cannot get enough money to have the house soon. Mm, so apartment is always a temporary place to them, but house is still a perfect accommodation to most of the people. We say a lot of our a lot of survey answers is about. Uh, prefer to live in house. People live at apartment for the reason of financial concerns. So increasing price of house should be most significant problem to our society. It uh, not only creates bubbles, also it influences people's life. So we should concern about it and our government should uh, have some methods to solve this solve these problems. Mm. This is our presentation. Thanks for watching.